Come on, you're supposed to be Snow White. Go crazy. Okay, is there an end to these guys? There. Hopefully that's the end of the chain. Yeah, I lost quite a bit of money there. You have to wonder why he's mad at me. I'm a princess. Or soon to be. Snow White wasn't officially a princess. I don't think. I can't remember my fairy tales all that well. Create this guy again. What is that? Okay. Whatever that was. Now how am I supposed to damage this guy? Damn, he's just killing the princesses off like they're nothing. Okay, that's easy to avoid. Okay, that not so much. Fight back! And back to these guys again. Okay, I get it. So in between fighting the toy soldiers, I need to chop his eye out. Good. Yeah, that's not so bad. Come on, peek in here again. Get a better view. You know you want to. Just ignore the phrase curiosity killed the cat. You're not a cat. What harm could it do? There you go. Good boy. Oh, wrong. That was too quick of a glance. Or glance. Glance? Something like that. Come on. Look through the peephole. I'll strip for you. Come on. Oh, great. He can go in more than just one direction. He can go diagonal now. There you go, good boy. But, oh, damn it. It didn't look long enough. I'm gonna really have to do that really fast, aren't I? Damn. Again! Damn that little kid. Quick, get over there. Got him. Obviously not enough, but still. Ignore the enemies. Just go after his eye. There's that Russian soldier thing. The Russian egg. Whatever it's called. things called? They're called Russian somethings. Wooden Russian... 
Damn, it's gonna bug me. Get there quick enough. Damn! Why does he keep doing that? He doesn't give me enough time. Come on, look through it again. Come on, you know you want to. You're gonna run out of princes sooner or later. Hope he knows that. Damn! He is accurate with that thing, isn't he? Come on, peek through again. There you go. Good boy. Not long enough. I'm getting massacred. Come on, look through again. Come on. Good. C rank, not so bad. All right, time for the next character. Now for time for chapter thirteen, Mascara Massacre. The pen may be mightier than the sword, but that doesn't. But that saying doesn't take Father Johnny into account. He collects all the old and forgotten books in the world and throw their, throws them all in the fire to keep his home warm and toasty. This serves as a grim reminder that you don't have much time left to fix your fame problem before your book is lost forever. I missed the last little sentence. So that pretty much means that he likes to throw our stories into the fire and ruin them. Okay, Mascara Massacre. The release princesses were running loose in the giant's house, but what our hero didn't know was that the kid giant had six brothers and wanted nothing more than revenge. Oh, I'm just kidding. Oh, thank you. He was an only child. That worried me for a second. I thought I was going to have to fight off against six more giants. Probably just one more, but dad. Let's see here. We got a giant fish hook that's a five star. And a giant key. Nice. What else we got? We got a comb, no thanks. And a crossbow, no thanks. I'll take the giant key. So the giant fish hook. Maybe we'll come across the beaver again. I am so dead. Yep. And there goes my fish hook. I can't keep nice things! Oh, I love this weapon. It kills the gnomes in one hit. A compass. How's a compass gonna work? I mean, sure, it's got a pointy edge, but still. Actually, that's not so bad. Okay, maybe it is. Oh, giant scissors. Awesome. You know, the naked emperor likes to do front flips, doesn't he? Nice view of his ass. Sure, we all wanted to see that. Okay, do not fall off the ledge again. Come on. He's trying to be some sort of acrobat. Oh, 
Yeah, this Emperor is not really good when it comes to fighting on narrow passageways. His flips and all that, that's gonna be dangerous. I think I'm gonna go back to the giant key, that was kinda useful. Nice blunt weapon. There we go. 